Hi, I'm Blake Tucker, aka Dr. Inkwell, and I want you to drink more, I want you to drink well. I also work as Beverage Director for Taste Catering, which is a certified women-owned business by the Women's Business Enterprise National Council, or WeBank. At WeBank, we love to promote and point at other women-owned businesses, and today I want to tell you about Uncle Nearest Whiskey. Fawn Weaver is a California entrepreneur and author turned Tennessee-based distillery owner. She learned the story of Uncle Nearest, who is the first recorded African-American distiller. Not only that, but he taught Jack Daniels how to distill. She wanted to commemorate his legacy, and so she created the Uncle Nearest brand. She is not only the first African-American to own a major spirits label, but she has women in key roles throughout her company, including Victoria Edie Butler, who's the master blender there and crafts the whiskeys. Victoria is a former Jack Daniels employee. Amazingly, Victoria is also the great-great-granddaughter of Uncle Nearest himself. This 1884 bottle is her first blend to hit the market. I'm excited to share this with you today in an old-school, old-fashioned, using gum syrup, which is a thicker syrup than you might normally use. Gum, this gum syrup comes from another women-owned business, the Small Hand Foods Company, run and owned by Jennifer Collio up in the North Bay. We're gonna make this drink in the glass, and it's pretty close to the old-fashioned recipe you already know. So the first step is to add ice to our glass, and then we're, we'll put in half an ounce of gum syrup. Next, we'll need two dashes of Angostura bitters and two dashes of Regan's orange bitters, and finally, two ounces of Uncle Nearest 1884. Next, we'll just stir this thoroughly and garnish with an orange twist. The Uncle Nearest Distillery is actually located on the former farm where Uncle Nearest taught Jack Daniels how to distill, and as it reopens in 2020, the tours will be led by Fawn Weaver herself. I hope to see you there. Cheers.